everyone, it is Tasha here from Namastasha and I just wanted to make a little video about a self-expression and kind of um, an update of what's been going on in my life right now. So um, I took a break for about a year from really like deeply going into any type of spiritual, emotional, um, like healing type of work. I was doing it kind of passively but not really like diving deep. So the last little while with my yoga teacher training, um, like I've really started to, to dig a lot deeper into things and um, I know some of the existing issues I still have are, have been like skin issues and stuff so I also recently started doing some colon hydrotherapy. So I've done two sessions of that now and I have the third on um, Sunday and it's been quite good actually. It was a little uncomfortable the first session but the the next one was a lot quicker, a lot easier and I'm really excited to see what the third one brings and how that just changes things because my skin was like kind of bumpy and stuff like that and now I still have breakouts and, and stuff but it really isn't um, quite as bad as it was getting to so I do feel like it's really working to clean out the colon and helping me to absorb nutrients better and just reduce the toxic load in my body. Um, so yeah, and then the teacher training, obviously doing the physical work of the asanas of yoga has been opening things up a lot for me and it's been a really um, interesting process and I haven't been really sure what was going to show up and I soon after the first module, which was four days of training for 10 hours each day, I did a 10 day clearing challenge with Laura Flater, which was really potent and really like it took a while to like shift into like quote unquote good things to start happening. Um, but it was just really like f flowing things out and cleansing the body. Um, and then things have now like started to shape and shift and have some perspective. Um, I just posted a video on expression and um, my own self-expression through words. Um, and I'm hoping to actually do more videos like that and just kind of have like, this is what I wrote today type of video. Because um, I think it's fun and I think it's a really good way uh, or something that I learned along my healing journey as something that is really powerful to express and, and let out um, and just let things flow and not really like judge the words that are coming out just writing whatever and that's what I did with that last piece. Um, I've also been exploring different types of healing uh, via artwork so I am actually have this henna done that's what the bandages are for um, and when Lori was doing this artwork on me um, and the way she was talking to me was about kind of blossoming like a flower and not caring if it's appreciated or not. It's just going to blossom regardless of that. So really focusing on doing this, um, you know, whatever expression, the way that you express yourself, that you're doing it for yourself and you're blooming for yourself and you're going through this growing and healing process for yourself, not for somebody else or to change your hair for someone else or buy clothes for someone else, but you're doing it for you and to feel good. Um, so yeah, so I've been exploring a few different things. I'm really excited about this artwork because I feel like once I got it done today, I've been so exhausted um, and I really was able to just give myself the time to just nap and let go and not be like, okay, I have a million other things to do. So I'm really shifting into this like instead of a cleansing perspective, which I was like, cleanse, 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 detox, detox, detox. It's more about... Uh, rejuvenation and restoring my body and um, just bringing things back to me and and also instead of being external I found I'm really a social person and I, I can get a lot of energy from socializing with other people but now I'm like kind of coming in and being like hey how can I find that and root into myself and feel that energy for myself and um, without needing external appreciation from other people and just appreciating myself and that um, as part of the reason I'm doing the yoga teacher training is for more self-acceptance self and self-love, um, which is something that was or has been lacking in my life for quite a while. So I think that the more that I am able to express myself in an authentic way, uh, the more that healing will come about because 
healing doesn't happen just through the foods that we eat. Uh, it's really a holistic thing in terms of the jobs that we have, the way that we talk with people, the relationships we have uh, with others as well as ourself. Um, and, and the more that we uh, t step away from the things that really give us that light, that f fire within to and that really ignites our passion and our souls, uh, the more that we walk away from that, the more that we're not going to feel good. So, um, really focusing on honing that in, and I think that there's lots of different ways for people to express themselves, whether it's through music, through movement, um, and through the words. So, yeah, that's kind of where I'm at right now. Namaste. Have a good day.